Part of the reason that the Miami Dolphins made all of the moves that they did this offseason was the strength of their conference, including the top dog in their own division. The Buffalo Bills have won the AFC East in back-to-back -back seasons with head coach Sean McDermott and quarterback Josh Allen leading the way. Miami hasn't defeated Buffalo since 2018, as they've lost 10 of their last 11 matchups. However, that doesn't stop a young player like linebacker Jalon Phillips from looking forward to their games. The Bills are incredibly talented, he said to the Miami Herald's Barry Jackson. And, we have a lot of talent this year. It's going to be really fun to have those games. The more times you go against somebody, the more comfortable you get. Just as much as I'm preparing for, Bills quarterback Josh Allen, he's preparing for us. I'm sure he will have some new tricks up his sleeve. He's an incredibly talented guy and somebody you always have to worry about, Allen has absolutely given the Dolphins his best effort in their previous battles. In eight games, Allen has thrown for 1,980 yards, 21 touchdowns and 5 interceptions for a 106.8 passer rating while rushing for another 430 yards and 4 touchdowns, Phillips is right about Miami's improved roster. Adding Taron Armstead, Connor Williams, Tyreek Hill, Cedric Wilson, Chase Edmonds and Raheem Mostert should help the Dolphins at least be competitive in these games. We've got a ton of talent, a ton of explosive guys, Phillips said. I'm excited to see what they can put together. I've got a lot of confidence in coach Mike McDaniel and our offensive coordinator Frank Smith, and everybody involved in play calling, Hill might be the most shocking addition for Phillips, considering the heights the wideout reached during his time with Kansas City, it's pretty crazy, Phillips said. Tyreek has been excellent at what he's doing since I've been in college. I look up to him as one of these crazy talented NFL players. It's wild to be on the same team and in the locker room with him, if Miami wants to finally knock off Buffalo, they'll have to rely on guys like Hill and Phillips to put pressure on the reigning AFC East champions and show that the team from South Florida deserves a shot at postseason football.